abacus classes good evening kids welcome back i hope kids you all are safe at home so stay home stay safe welcome to my abacus classes as you all know this is your abacus class and i am your abacus teacher miss karima singh so kids in my previous video i have told you some sums sums related to the units rod and i have done those sums here on the whiteboard and i have also told you to do that sums in your apicus notebook and i have also told you that sums on paper and tool i hope students you get my previous video and i hope that you have completed your work in your abacus notebook so kids make sure you watch every single video and stay tuned to learn more so now kids we will come to our today's topic kids today first of all i will tell you something about the abacus tool then i will move to your today's topic so as you can see this is your abacus tool i have drawn and these are your upper beads and these are your lower beads as you already know the mid rod which contains the dot mid rod jisme dot hoti hai that rod is called units rod or you can say it ones rod and the rod just besides the units rod is the tens rod we call it tens rod so kids you have to learn it learn it means you have to learn the names of these two rods it is very very important if you will know the parts of abacus and the beads you can easily do your abacus sums so kids now the labeling of the beads as you know this bead is 5 in your first standard also you have learned very nice this is bead 1 and 1 2 3 4 as you know 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 nice kids now this is your bead 50 means this bead value is 50 if i will put it down means you have added 50 this bead value is 50 i hope kids you remember in your first class i have told you the bead which goes above the line jo bead line ke ऊपर चली जाती है वो बड़ी हो जाती है एंड इट बिकम्स फाइव तो सेम वे दिस इज फाइव नाउ जस्ट बिसाइड्स द फाइव वन मोर बीट इज देयर दिस इज कॉल्ड बीट फिफ्टी नाउ द बीड विच गोज अब द लाइन जो लाइन के ऊपर जाती है और इस डॉट के जिस साइड में जिस बिसाइड द रोड वो और बड़ी हो जाती है एंड इट बिकम्स फिफ्टी स्पीड इज फिफ्टी एंड दिस इज टेन सो वी कैन से टेन ट्वेंटी थर्टी फोर्टी किट्स दिस यू हैव टू लर्न it's very important as without this you can't do your apicus only this much you have to learn like this bead is 5 this is 1 2 3 4 it is the rod which contains dot the mid rod and just besides the mid rod just mid rod ke kinare mein your tens rod is there and the upper bead is 50 50 just learn it 50 upper bead value is 50 and lower is 10 20 30 40 10 20 30 now kids i hope you are getting it just learn it now kids i will tell you about the beads up and down 
सी इफ आई हैव टू एड फाइव अगर मुझे फाइव को एड करना है तो मैं क्या करूंगी बट आई विल डू सी आई विल पुट दिस फाइव पीट डाउन मैं इस फाइव पीट को नीचे कर दूंगी एंड फाइव विल गेट एडेड और फाइव एड हो जाएगा फाइव एड हो गया है अंडरस्टैंडिंग किड्स वेरी नाइस इफ आई टू एड फिफ्टी अगर मुझे फिफ्टी एड करना है आई पुट दिफ्टी बीट डाउन एंड इट इज एडेड सो हाउ यू एड अपर बीट्स आप अपर बीट्स को कैसे एड करते हो उन्हें नीचे करके उन्हें इस लाइन से स्टिक करके सी दीज बीट्स आर स्टिकिंग टू द लाइन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल दे आर अप पहले ये ऊपर थी नाउ यू हैव पुट टाइम डाउन and now they are sticking to the line so they are added ye add ho chuki hai so now you know how you add upper beads aap upper beads ko kaise add karte ho by putting them down if someone will say that how you will add five so what you will do you will put the five bead down or you can put the 50 bead down to add 50 Now kids, about these down beads, you can say it lower beads. How you add them? See, if I have to add one, so I will put one bead up. Now I have added one. So how you add the lower beads? Up for adding, down for minus. Up for adding, down for minus. As this bead touches the bar, जैसे ही ये बीड इस बार को टच करता है इस बीड की वैल्यू हो जाती है सो फॉर एडिंग यू हैव टू पुट दीड अप लोअर बीड्स अप एंड फॉर सब्रैक्टिंग यू हैव टू पुट द बीड्स डाउन सी एड करने के लिए आपको बीड्स को ऊपर करना होता है और सब्रैक्ट करने के लिए आपको बीड्स को नीचे करना होता है बट हेयर इट इज डिफरेंट अगर आपको ऐड करना है इफ यू वॉन्ट टू एड यू हैव टू पुट द बीट डाउन एंड इफ यू हैव टू माइनस यू हैव टू पुट द बीट अप सी हेयर इज डिफरेंट केस यू कैन सी द एरोज केट्स दे आर डिफरेंट इफ यू हैव टू एड द लोअर बीट यू हैव टू पुट इट अप एंड इफ यू हैव टू माइनस यू हैव टू पुट इट डाउन बट इट इज डिफरेंट फॉर अपर बीड्स ये अपर बीड्स के लिए अलग है इफ यू हैव टू एड यू हैव टू पुट द बीड डाउन एंड इफ यू हैव टू माइनस यू हैव टू पुट द बीड अप जस्ट वॉच इट केयरफुली केट्स फॉर एडिंग वी आर डूइंग अप हेयर फॉर एडिंग वी आर डूइंग डाउन केट्स टूडे दिस इज सम टिप्स दीज टिप्स आई हैव explain you in my previous videos a lot and this thing we have done also now you will say when in my previous video i have told you to do the sums like this and we have done also the sums in our units on ones rod so you have done the sums now you are well aware and today i am telling this to make you learn it I think it's you all get this one quick revision the mid dot rod is called units rod or ones rod just besides the units or one rod is tens rod this is bead 1 this is bead 1 2 3 4 this is bead tan 20 30 40 This is bead five. This is bead fifty. These are called upper beads. These are called lower beads. If you have to add the upper bead, you have to put it down. And if you have to minus the upper bead, you have to put it up. But it is opposite for lower beads. अगर आपको bead को add करना है, if you have to add the bead, you have to put it up. And for minus, you have to put it down. students just learn this you can do every sum of abacus too now kids we were moving to our today's topic which is worksheet now kids 
with this video i have provided you one worksheet worksheet you can say it abacus activity also in that sums are there so you have to solve them now on the whiteboard i will tell you how you will solve those sums one to two sums i will tell you how to solve then rest of the worksheet you have to complete it in your abacus notebook by yourself see kids can you see these two lines these two lines i am drawing here See kids now. These two lines I have taken out from abacus tool and I have drawn here. So these two lines and these two lines are the same. Now, what you have to do? See, in that worksheet, I have put the sums like this. Now you have to count them. आपको इन्हें count करना है. These types of sums are there in your worksheet. Now how you will count these? See kids, to do this worksheet sum, there are two types. आप दो तरीकों से इस sum को कर सकते हैं. How? See, I have told you this bead is fifty. So this is fifty, and fifty you have added. And how much it is? See, five, six, seven. So it is seven. Now add them. So fifty plus seven is fifty-seven. This way also you can do one type of thing. See two methods. I'm telling you the method which you found easy. Use that method. See, this is fifty. You know, this is five, six, seven, fifty-seven, fifty-seven. Now second method, see, count individually. First of all, one rod, then second rod. The first rod is five, six, seven. So seven here. And see here five, so five here. This way also you can do. When you are counting the rods individually, individually means a kale. When you are counting it individually, you can call it five. आप इसे five count करके नीचे लिख सकते हैं लाइक सेकेंड एग्जाम्पल नो काउंटेड सी यू हैव टू काउंट दे Now you can see kids. This is down means it is added. This is beat fifty, and you can see here nothing is added. See five is down. No means five is not added. See any beat is up. No nothing is added. So only fifty is added. So you can write directly fifty. Fine. And your second method now. See it. Anything is added in this rod? No. Nothing means zero. And in this rod, what is added? See five. Same answer will come. Kids, this is fifty when you are counting both the rods when you are adding. But if you are at taking individual rods, अगर आप एक एक rod करके लेंगे तो आप इसे easily लिख सकते हैं. Again, we will go to our next sum. I'm telling you the sums with both the methods. The method which you found easy, you can do your sums with that method. See now, this is your. rods this is unit rod this is tens rod and i am making the beads here
Now see, we will take both the methods. First of all, the first method, then the second method. See, this is 50 and this is 10. So how much it becomes? 60. This is 50 and 10. This becomes 60. And see 5 is added? No. Only 1 is added. So 60 plus 1? 61. This is a method of counting the beads together. Now we will count it individually. We will count it individually. See what is the answer? 61. Now, now your second method to count. See, first of all, see one's rod. How much is added? See, one is added. So one here. And here, see, count it now. Five. Five, six. You can do like this also. When you are counting it individually, when you are counting it individually, first of all this, then this, then you can take it 5. Are you getting my point? Now next sum, I will do with the second method only. Now see, first of all count the ones rod, 5, 6, because 5 is added. Now kids, count the next. See, 5 is added, 5, 6, 7, 8, 86. Now kids, you can do by both of these methods, you can count it 50, then also 86 will come. And if you will count it individually, individually means first of all this rod counting and writing, then this rod counting and writing. So you can take it as 5. But if you are adding both the rods, then you have to take it 50. See, I will tell. This is 50 and this is 10. So now count it. 50, 60, 70, 80. And this is 5, 6. So 80 and 6. 80 plus 6. 86. Both things you can do. Now kids, like these sums, I have made one worksheet or the PDF for you. See, this PDF is very important as it will make you learn how to Count the beads in Apicus tool. ये आपको सिखाएंगे कि आप Apicus tool में beads कैसे count कर सकते हो. See here, beads are there and you are counting them and you are writing it down. Same way in that worksheet, I have provided you this. Like these, the sums are there in your worksheet. Count the beads and just write here in the blank space provided by me. So kids, it is a worksheet. So first of all, you have to draw the beads. Aapko ye beads apni Abacus notebook mein banani hai. Then you have to count it. Then aapko count karni hai. Aur yahan par likhni hai. You can use both the methods. Aap dono methods se kar sakte ho. If you find the first one easy, you can use the first one. If you find the second one easy, you can use the second one also. I hope kids you like my video and I hope that you get the sums done by me. Make sure you watch every single video and stay tuned to learn more. This much for today. Next time new topic, new sums and something new in Avicus. So thank you and have a nice day. Practice the worksheet at home. Like and subscribe the video. Thank you.